All righty. Well, today we're not in the garage. We're on a little road trip, heading to a family reunion. And we just stopped here in Penguich. You can see, oh yeah, you can see the gas station. That's all you can see. Michelle's in here, Austin's in here. And we just stopped and got ourselves a little treat. I got an ice cream cone. Austin got the biggest ice cream thing he can find. Michelle, what'd you get? She copied me. Copy it's been her. raining the whole way down here. So we'll show you a little bit of that. Here's what we see outside the gas station here. Outside of Penguich. Penguich, Utah. There's something following us though. Been trying to lose it. Look at my mirror though. We busted out the boat that's been in the garage that you've probably seen in the back of my garage. It's been back there for quite a few years. We'll see if it can make it. We're on our way to Lake Powell, somewhere down there. Hopefully it's not raining down there. I wouldn't be fun to drag a boat six hours just to rain that get rain on okay we're probably a half hour outside of Penguich maybe a little longer and someone not sure who that someone is mm -hmm. keeps ripping them in the truck <laughs> and then denying it not sure who that could be look how beautiful it is down here in southern Utah yeah, it's fine. The sun broke through beautiful Okay, we're entering the big town of Glendale. I know very little about this town, but it's a cool town. This is where Fab Rats and crew live. One day I'm gonna stop and get a, maybe the, on the way back home, I'll stop and get a sticker. Right here to the left, there is a place right there. It has all kinds of classic cars. We stopped in one day and talked to him about that blue Ford that's still sitting there. And what asked Billy if he would sell that. He said some guy from Phoenix uh, already said that he wanted to buy that. That was a couple years ago. I probably should stop and talk to him again. Yeah, Fabrats is down here somewhere. Let's see if we can find him. It's not down that one, it's down one of these streets. <coughs> down one of these streets. Yeah, I think it's that one. Yep, last street in town. Got some cool stuff over there, Pasta. Where? Cool projects down there. Where? Down there, back there. All righty, six hours of driving, and we're entering Paige. Still got Michelle, Austin, and me. We're gonna cross the dam, I'll show you that. Okay, well the picture across the bridge or the video didn't work so well. Thought I'd show you this. Wind's blowing out here. We had to pull over the side of the freeway and I jumped out because this thing was dangling. It's hanging by one bolt, so I took care of that. We'll have to fix that. It's windy though, down here. Hey. All right, we're here on Lake Powell. Beautiful day. Let's see, who do we got in the boat? We got pasta. We got Wyatt, we got Jen who's hiding, I'm hiding. <laughs> and we got some unknown kids. Picked them up around the shoreline, we're not sure who they are, but it's a beautiful day. <laughs> okay, this is what it looks like at our front window. I rolled down the side window. That's the dam, so you can see that. That's one side of the bridge. Here's the other side of the bridge. And it's a long ways down there. Come on. Uh, Didn't want to fall down there. Let's go flip jumping. Yeah, it's pretty cool though. That's the bridge. Alrighty, we have a broken windshield on the four-wheeler down here. And here's what we need. We need a bolt and a bracket like this 
because this goes over that windshield mount and then tightens down. Here's a here's a bracket with two of them. Apparently, one of them's been lost, and the dealer doesn't have a solution. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna make our own. So I went down to Ace Hardware, got the same size bolt, just a 3 8 bolt. We're gonna chop off the head of the bolt, weld this nut on. I've already drilled this nut to be the same diameter. And then we're gonna use this washer, and we are going to make our own little, little bracket. So, Seth's gonna weld this on. We're gonna go over to his house and weld this on. Seth is gonna cut the head off. That is mucho nastio. Okay, here's what it looks like after Seth welded and grinded. The one on the left is the new one. It'll work perfect. Okay, here's what it looks like with a little bit of paint on it. I think we're in business. Seth does good work. Okay, that worked. Our bolt allowed us to put this windshield back on. It's better than ever. Now we're off to our next project since it's raining outside. Can't go on the lake when it's raining. So we'll work on something else. And that something else we're going to take a look at Matt's uh, 2006 Toyota Sienna that has a Code P0402 or 420, which is the Bank One oxygen sensor. So we're going to see if we can clean that a little bit. Okay, we sprayed a bunch of cleaner up in the cat. And we uh, are about ready to start it. It's been sitting for a few hours. We're not sure if it's going to send a, a fireball out the tailpipe or not. Fire it up, Matt. Oh, that was uneventful. I was hoping for a fireball. Alrighty, we got up at 4 o'clock this morning. It's probably, I don't even know if it's 5. And uh, we're out here on Lake Powell. And we're going to try to catch some stripers. We got me and Wyatt. We got Matt. And pasta's here somewhere. Austin. Austin La Pasta. And then in front of us we have, whoa, that was a close up. We have Seth and, and group. Let's get a picture of them. Okay, here's what it looks like at five o'clock in the morning on Lake Powell. Absolutely beautiful. Glass water. Yep, glass water, why? We're, we're on our way to the, to the base of the dam, but there's so many rocks over here because the water's so low that we have to go really slow through this area. So there's Seth and the walkers. So, and Sarah. It's a beautiful day. Makes it worth it getting up. Okay, Wyatt's got one. Wyatt's got something. Let the drag out a little bit, Wyatt. Drag out. Matt's got it. Oh, look Whoa. at this one! Woohoo! Woohoo! Yeah. Uh, what did I say? I was gonna catch it first. Oh, yeah, Wyatt caught a nice one. That's a nice one. It's like a little bit of tugs that, that that's what you gotta pay attention to. Okay, grab the pliers. Come on, Dad, get over here. Alrighty, we are leaving Paige. Bye bye, Lake Pal. Today's probably the best day out of the bunch, and we did not go on the lake since it's Sunday. Okay, we're out of here. <laughs>